A private company is all set to make history. Japanese startup iSpace is set to land its Hakuto mission spacecraft on the moon. The Rashid rover developed by the United Arab Emirates will be part of the world's first lunar landing by a private company if it succeeds. The M1 lander is all set to touch down in less than an hour. The emission the mission was launched by a SpaceX rocket in December last year from Florida. A 2.3 meter tall M1 began an hour long landing phase from its current position in the moon's orbit some 100 kilometers above the surface. It will be moving at nearly about 6,000 kilometers per hour during the descent. If it lands successfully, then Japan would have become the third nation to achieve this milestone. Only the United States and the former Soviet Union and China have soft landed a spacecraft on the moon. The recent attempts by India and a private Israeli company have ended in failure. Now, after reaching the landing site in the moon's northern hemisphere, the M1 is to deploy a two-wheeled baseball-sized rover developed by JAXA, as well as the United Arab Emirates' four-wheeled Rashid rover. Rashid rover will mark the beginning of a momentous week for the United Arab Emirates space program. Emirati astronaut Sultan Al Niyadi is also to make a spacewalk on Friday. And if successful, the United Arab Emirates would have become the first Arab nation to have a spacecraft on the surface of another celestial body. Beyond is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news on the move.